Michael, one exercise I've been thinking about for you um, after our session, just thinking about core stability and a little bit of just kind of re-education around the hips and the pelvis. So this is a nice one, kind of an isometric hip clock. So what you may want to start with just to free up the hips is hands kind of downward pressure on kind of the thighs into the hip joint and just little circles. And that's nice to free up the hips, maybe about eight in each direction. But then what you're gonna look for, what you're gonna do, Michael, is you're gonna do an isometric of hip flexion. So pressing into the thighs as the thighs pull back against you, trying to keep the length of the spine, the abdominal wall drawing in. Then you can go to abduction trying to keep about just like sacrum distance between the legs. So I'm pressing in on the legs as the legs are pressing out back to me. You can try adduction, so hands across and pressing outward on the thighs as they draw back in. You can do hip extension, so pressing the legs forward into the hands as the hands pull back against you. And then last but not least, Again, kind of like a posterior glide, the idea is not necessarily tucking the pelvis, but I'm pressing down as I'm trying to kind of lift my pelvis up a bit for that isometric. And the idea would be, Michael, maybe about three, two to three breaths with each of those, and you can always repeat that full series. Hope this helps.